Hello, everyone. Welcome. Uh, we'll get started shortly. All right. Welcome, everyone. Welcome. Welcome everyone. All right, this is um, Q and A. So on Mondays we do Q and A. I want to go over the market. So welcome, welcome. Um, the news of the day. All right, I'll go over the markets and then I'll open up the floor for any questions. Uh, is the equity markets okay? So the equity equity markets continue to move higher. We had another up day in the markets today. All right, so. This is the Dow here, and it's almost recovered um, from the move last month uh, down. All right. So here we are right here. So basically we covered all of the losses for last month. All right. We'll look for the Dow to recapture the moving average here. So this green line here is the moving average. All right. We can count this as resistance right over here. So... Um, and if that happens, uh, we could see where the market holds and perhaps uh, continue to move higher. All right, that 30,000 mark was a big number. So that 30,000 mark here, right down in here, was a big number for the Dow. But like I said, it's recovered nicely and looking to move higher. All right. Um, we do have buy signals. All right, so we do have buy signals on um, on the equity markets on, on the 240 minute time frame. All right, so on the 240 minute time frame, 
um, we've got buy signals. Okay, so let's take a look here. All right. So buy signal here, that's on the Dow. Buy signal here. All right. Hey, Gerald, welcome. Buy signal hey. here. Hey, David. Hello on the S&P. Buy signal here on the Russell. Uh, we do not have a buy signal yet on the NASDAQ, but that should come. All right. That should come soon. So we've got... Uh, no, we don't have real confirmation, right? We would like to see the, these buy signals coming on the daily time frames, uh, but we'll count this, all right? We'll count this. Uh, so we are we are calling a buy signal on the equity markets. If it changes, if things change, then we'll we'll you know we'll change our mind, all right? Um, but uh, buy signal. Okay, so that's good news for our equity traders, all right? Hey, Charity, welcome, all right? So just remember that. So we'll be, um, we don't want to get too aggressive right now, all right? But certainly we can start buying, buying stocks, okay? Um, and we'll go over uh, the sector to buy, okay? So again, buy signal here on the Dow, New buy signal came in here on the S&P. We already had a buy signal here, all right, on the Russell. Um, so we're waiting for, we, if, we, if the market is up tomorrow, we could get a buy signal uh, tomorrow on, um, on the NASDAQ, all right? VIX is holding, coming down, holding, coming down a bit here. Uh, we do have a new up in biotech, so that's good, right? So uh, biotech is joining energy. Here is energy here, and that's up right here. And then we have a new up. It says new up right here in, um, in biotech. So that's good. All right. So we should start seeing some biotech stocks um, move higher. So good news, good news, good news, good news for the equity markets. Um, so we might get that Christmas rally after all. All right. Um, October is usually, that's where, when we usually get buy signals, right? So fourth quarter, October, right? Sometimes early October, mid, late October. Um, uh, sometimes even November is where we start to see the market move higher to finish up the year strongly, okay? All that Christmas buying, all that Thanksgiving buying, that's usually really, really good um, for the market. So um, historically, that's what happens, okay? That's what happens. So um, uh, so it's good to see. It's good to see, all right? It's following its historical uh, trend, all right? Uh, let's see here. All right, any questions on this? So this is Q&A. So any questions on, on the market's development and what's happening here? Any questions? All right. Uh, stop me if you guys have any questions. All right. Um, keep an eye on um, the dollar, um, the dollar. All right, um, it's coming down a bit. Um, I made an error today with the dollar pairs. Um, so the dollar pairs are not given by signals. Okay, that was an old, um, old alert. So the dollar pairs are not given by signals. Okay, we did see some buy signals in the yen pairs. Okay, but not in the dollar pairs. Um, we are watching the dollar here on this on the daily time frame and it's currently down right equity markets are moving higher right here okay um but we are looking at the dollar index here hey bill welcome all right so we're looking at we have a wide candle here on the dollar index if it breaks this support here and as the market's been moving higher that that's going to put a lot of pressure on um on the dollar all right and we looked last night we looked at the dollar index last night and we 
we notice that it was over way overbought all right on the monthly time frame it's way overbought way overextended so it's due for a pullback okay <clears throat> excuse me so this area here if it breaks this support area right here we we, we should get a sell signal okay so keep an eye on that all right, so here is our buy signal here, break of this resistance, and that's the recent buy. All right, but where, here we are here with a white candle. All right, if, if um, you know, right now it's down. If that continues, we could break through this support here, and then we'll have to get a sales signal, okay? And then we'll be out of dollar. We're not in the dollar pairs right now, but we'll be, we'll just have to wait until we get another buy signal here. Okay, um, and if that happens, if we do get a sell signal here, we could see that the dollar come down a bit, right? Where on the equity market, stock market move higher. So that's what's happening right now. All right, that's what's happening right now. Um, and uh, let's see here. Any questions on the dollar, guys? Any? You should. You guys should not be in any dollar pairs. Okay, um, there is a few, uh, let's see right here. There is one or two that's still holding. Um, let's see here. Mm -mm. But if you guys notice here in Monster Scalper, it's all new down, down and new down, right? Right down, new down. Okay, so they're, they're moving lower, all right? So no buy signals. This on the 240, right? Right here. Coming going through that markdown phase. So we think that that um dollar trade might be done for a while. Nothing here. A lot of consolidation. See here? All right. I wouldn't short this. I wouldn't short it. All right, selling, coming in here. All right, I think USD, CNH is still strong. Yeah, so USD, CNH. So if, if, you, if anyone is in this, you can still continue to hold it. I think it's the only one that's still um, performing well. All right, uh, USD, CHF, I think that, yeah, that gave a, um, a buy signal here, but it's not looking good. All right, and then dollar CAD, same thing here. So, um, so we can see that price action here is affecting the the dollar pairs. Okay, so, um, even on the sixty minute, like I said, that was a, that was an error today, with buy signals, on the dollar, on the sixty minute time frame, we don't have anything there. Okay, nothing there on the 60 minute, all right? Um, here is the energy sector. We talked about this, okay? We talked about this. We've been talking about energy stocks. So pay attention to your energy, pay attention to energy stocks, all right? Um, uh, right here, here are your sectors right here. Had a decent update today, all right? Um, but look at this. It's moving higher. Energy is definitely moving higher. All right. Here is the buy signal here. And this is on a daily time frame. So this was Thursday of last week, Friday, and then today. So it's moving higher. Um, we'll hope it looks to test the high right up here. Okay. And then perhaps move higher. Okay. But this is an early move here. So anyone in any... Um, uh, Energy stocks are looking at any energy stocks. Anyone? Anyone? Uh, Charity, are you have you looked at any? I know you use um, Stock Boss. Have you looked at any energy stocks? Uh, let's see. Energy. Uh, yeah, I'm trying to remember which ones they are. Up, but um, I did get in a couple of them today. Okay, you did. Okay. Uh do you know you you know the symbols? 
Uh, not off the top of my head, but I think one of them is uh, XLM. XLM? Yeah. Okay, we'll look to take a look at that. Um, okay, biotech, new up. We'll keep an eye on biotech. All right, um, so we have a new up here, and here it is here. All right, but we don't have a buy signal yet. We don't even have green candles yet, but we'll keep an eye on it. Uh, you know, biotech made a, 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 a decent run last time and then faded. Uh, but we're, we've got pretty good support right here. All right, pretty good support. Uh, if we can get above this resistance right here, in this area right here, we could get a buy signal, okay? So we'll keep an eye on biotech. Uh, but energy, energy is uh, the only sector right now that's, that's performing, that's, you know, still early, but looking well. All right, looking well. Uh, let's see here. Uh, I haven't looked at Stock Boss. Let's see what's in Stock Boss. Yeah. So we've got 49, 49 stocks in Stock Boss. All right, here are the energy stocks here. Let's see what's setting up. Uh, and Charity, you said X, X, L, M. Uh, Sorry, it's actually H, L, X, and then R, E, S, res. Okay, so H, L, X, and which is the other one? R, E, S. R, E, S. Okay, so R, E, S is here. Let's see that. Okay, let's change that. That's uh <clears throat> okay oh very nice uh when did you get in today or yes uh, today or friday i'm assuming today. today today okay all right looks very nice looks very nice okay uh, just hold on to it hopefully we we'll get a move like this, <laughs> like this here. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so just hold on. All right. Um, I think this is your second. This is your second or third rotation with Stock Boss. Is this your? This is your third. It's technically, the second because the first one kind of went in and out a couple of times. Yeah. So this. Yeah. So this will be your first. Your second second rotation. Um, so you know what to do, all right? You know what to do here, all right? Yep. Yeah. You know what to do. Um, uh, let's see here. And the the next one was H H L X, which is down here. Uh, H L X, which is down here. All right. Uh, um, nice. It's a little high, okay. Um, but that's fine, okay. That's um, if energy continues to hold um, here. So here we have resistance, pretty good resistance here. This is where we got the last buy signal and it failed. This is where we have pretty good resistance support right here. This is where it closed the last buy signal. And um, here we've got another buy signal right here. So this area here, charity is a big, it's an important area. Okay, so if you can get past, and we're getting, we know it's moving higher, but if we can get past this area in here, perhaps get past in here, and then especially in here, all right? But this area right here, right where it's breaking out, look at that perfect buy signal here, and it's uh, not expensive at all. 
So it's 480, closed at 480 today. Okay, so good job. Good job. Yeah, that's the one thing that I still haven't like solidified in my head is to draw those lines. I think I just get like trying to make decisions a little bit faster. <laughs> and it yeah. does take a little time to draw out the lines and remember to do that, but I'm getting better at that part. Yeah, it takes a little practice. Um, but try, just try. What you can do is, um, just like I did, open up your 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 chart a bit, right? So um, if you look here, uh, and everyone, if you look here, so your chart in Stockbox looks like this, right? Um, but if you bring your cursor to the corner here, and then kind of pull your chart, right? You can pull it like this right here, and then you get more data, right? And then you can see uh, a bit more clear, clearly here. And then just mm -hmm. go to go to right click on your on your on the on a blank area. Don't click on the on the candles, right? Just on a blank area. Uh, drawings. Go to drawings and horizontal line and then just click and it will come in okay and what you want to do is find those points find those points the high points so here was a high point here we can count this this is where it 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 made a high but then it came back it failed all right and then but this is closer so here so we know this area right here we have a right it didn't break this area and then this area here you could see we got pretty good support here right pretty good support we consider that resistance this area here it failed so we count this area here obviously here that's easy here and then here and then here we are right now okay so it's a perfect buy right at that break of resistance and then if we draw a trend line right here, we can see prices being squeezed here. Okay, so um, now it, it could fail like it did here, like it did here. But if the markets, if you get this, if you get the sector behind you, right? So we know the crude oil sector, energy sector, it's moving higher, right? So that will help. And then if the market move is moving higher, which it is, right? That will help. All right, and then the dollar is coming down. So, so good job. Just hold, hold, hold. <laughs> okay. Yeah, hold. All a lot of that nervousness should be um, going away. All right, and then the more the more we do it, every rotation we should be getting better. Right, every rotation. Right, that that calmness. We should get more calm. We should be expecting this, right? So as we're expecting this rotation, right? And then the next rotation will be easier. And and at some point, you know, um, it, be, it just becomes second nature um, and we'll be in the right. The goal is to be in the right sector, all right? So um, uh, let's see here. Uh, I want to look at a few more energy stocks. So here is another one here. All right. That's another one here. We don't need a perfect, um, we don't need a perfect um, markdown phase. All right. We don't need a perfect markdown phase. Um, because if you guys look at the, and stop me if you guys have any questions. If you, if we look at the, sectors here if we look at the the sector for energy it doesn't have a perfect markdown phase so it's moving from here right it's moving from a high here not a you know some consolidation in here all right so it's not perfect so we can't expect um these equity these um, um energy stocks to be perfect okay all right, so so here's another one here. 
All right, breaking resistance. You guys see that? Breaking resistance here. Um, it doesn't have a lot of data, so it must have been, it must, this must be a new, a new IPO, new stock here. So here is resistance here, and it's breaking resistance. All right, here is resistance right here. So charity, yes, yeah, start practicing with your bringing in your lines, right? Start doing that. Yeah. All right, well, this is good here. Uh, let's take a look at a few more. And, all right, here's another one here. And again, this will look a lot like, um, a lot like the energy sector. So TTI, look at that. I know it. the chart doesn't look pretty. <laughs> Not a very pretty chart here, but look at this. Nice consolidation. Um, Bill, are you in any any of any energy stocks? No, no, no. I'm not. Okay. All right. So um let's see here. How about Gerald Kawisi? Are you guys looking at any energy stocks? You guys should look at this. Here, 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 and now here. All right, so here is all this area here, here. All right, this is where it failed, 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 right? Definitely failed here, failed, failed, and now here we are here. So Hopefully, this is, uh, remember, we're constantly testing, testing support and resistance, right? So hopefully, this is the one here, all right? Um, if it fails, no big deal. Get out. All right, so TTI, and it's at 466, so not bad. And I don't know where crude oil finished. Um, I think it was about 85. Um, but I don't know where it finished for the day. Um, but we'll watch it. We'll we'll watch it more closely. Um, PR. All right. This was one here to put on your on your radar here. Nice markdown phase, right? Nice markdown phase. Um, uh, green candles. So buyers are coming in, just waiting for a buy signal. All right, and that's A R O C. All right, A R O C. All right, here's another one here. Good markdown phase. Buyers are coming. So you guys see, they're definitely getting in this. Uh, this one has already moved. Too late to get into that one. All right, here's another one here. Oh, this is yours. Yeah. HLX charity. All right, here's one, another one here. It's already left. Uh, too late. Right, buy signal was here, and it's all the way up here. All right, KOS no buy signal yet. Uh, here is another good one here. NR NR that's energy also. All right, so nice this in markdown phase. Right, buy signal here, getting in that markup phase. All right, here is another one here. This is a good one here. All right, so this one looks really good. It's got pretty good resistance here. All right, pretty good resistance. Pretty good support. Nice consolidation. All right, nice consolidation. And now it's breaking out. All right. You guys see that? So nice. Right here, nice consolidation. All right. Made the highs here, lows here. All right, even here, we can count this. We can count this. So it's there's no consolidation in here, right? No consolidation in here. We wouldn't count this spike. So, all right, it's clear, all right? Nothing in the way to move higher. 
to block it to, from moving high, okay? So all these here, all right, so it's clear. All right. Any questions on any of these? All right. Okay. Uh, Bull Master. Let's take a look at Bull Master. So these are going to be a bit more expensive, but look at here, all these energy stocks. And I just want to go through these quickly. So we got you guys. Nothing here. So buy signal there. Look at this one here. Right here. This is an energy stock. All right. Buy signal here all the way up here. All right. And it's early. Early in this move. Another one here. Look, look, just look in this area right here, guys. Another one here. Another one here. Nothing yet here. There's another one here. That's a perfect, nice markdown phase. All right, buy signal here. All right. That's pump. I think we looked at pump the other day. All right. We're just waiting for a buy signal here. All right. And hopefully, with this one, we get another move like this. Nice markdown phase. All right. We're not buying up in this area here. All right, so energy, energy, energy right now. There's another one moving. New buy signal here. Look at this one here, buy signal here. Really get, they're really getting in. All right, so in the last, this was buy signal came in on uh, last Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, and then this candle is today. So it went from uh, so almost three points. So from twenty dollars to almost twenty three dollars. Okay, and for stocks, that's really good. All right, straight up, straight up. All right, P A R R. And here's nothing here yet. Setting up. Nothing yet. Yet setting up. Still accumulating. New buy signal right here. Lots of opportunities. I mean, this is an expensive stock here. Okay. All right. So you guys see what's happening, right? You guys see what's happening here. Here is a nice one here. That's not too expensive. Ten dollars. All right. Those of you who are not, if you're not in any of this, this is this is not a bad one. To, to get in and try, right? At least get in the rotation, right? Right, nice markdown phase, right? Perfect buy signal here, okay? On the break here, $10, all right? And it's part of energy, all right? And that is uh, OLL. I think we've talked about that one, yeah. All right, so, so that is definitely the rotation. I see, I think you guys see that. Definitely the rotation coming out of um, the selling in the market. Here's another one here. Okay. And what we've noticed is that even with the market, being bearish sometime on certain days, right? These stocks are continuing to move higher. All right. There's another one here. So a lot of opportunities here. Okay, lots of opportunities here in energy. Lots of energy stocks. And you guys remember... Uh, you know, a month ago, three weeks ago, even two weeks ago, right? We didn't have, uh, we didn't have any stocks, here, yeah, um, in Heat Seeker. So lots of opportunities here. All right. 
Any questions for me? Any questions for me? You guys are quiet. Be sitting. Uh, no rotation yet. Um, uh, in forex, we're watching um Bitcoin. Surprisingly, Bitcoin hasn't moved. Bitcoin we usually move with the equity markets, so it's still holding here. It's at nineteen thousand and change. So still very tight consolidation. You can see that in here. Very, very, look at that. All right, this is a weekly time frame. So look at that. Amazing, All right? Look at that. One, two, three, four, five, six weeks, All right? We'll count this, All right? Seven, eight, nine weeks of basically flat line, All right? So two months, all right, two months of total, you know, it's it's dried up for now. Okay. So nothing, nothing there. All right. We'll be looking at um Monster Forex tracker. All right, we'll watch it to see what's um what's developing. All right. Um on the 60 minutes, on 60 minute time frame. All right. So Nothing yet um, on the um, uh, on the 240 price is consolidating a bit. OK, so um, we've gone from 57. We have 57 pairs that we track. And right now we've got uh, 27, only 27 pairs, guys, that are above um, 20. OK, so. Um, you know, we talked about this. We, we got a lot of white, a lot of white after Friday. So um, just not a lot of opportunities right now. Okay. So hopefully if things will open up, um, you know, even on the, um, on the 60 minute, it's at 33. So even on the 60 minute, um, we have 30, 33 pairs that are over 20. Okay, but that doesn't mean you can't find um, opportunities. Okay, you just have to be very selective. All right, here's Zaire, welcome. Okay, so uh, if you guys want to trade, if you want to trade, want to look for opportunities in 4X, I would go to the 60 minute, okay? And you can look for opportunities, but be careful. All right, um, the yen pairs on the 60 minute, um, let me see if there's anything here to trade that's tradable. Boy, Friday really did a job on 4X. Yeah, there's nothing. The 60 minute is right here. And there's absolutely nothing in the yen pairs. So we just wait, right? We just wait. Uh, dollar pairs. I know we don't have anything in the dollar pairs. Let's see here. Dollar pairs. We're looking at this window here. This is the 60. That's the 240. So nothing. 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 Nothing in 4X. Nothing uh, in 4X. Error. Is that here? Oh yeah. Um. So when you get a chance, I have two calls that I have. So, but when you're done, you can take a look at it from me. Okay. These are calls. Yeah. Okay. All right. What are the symbols, Aya? So one is K O. K O. Okay. And the other is W M T. W M T. So that's, that's that Walmart? Well, yes. Okay. So let's take a look at KO. And these are calls. All right. So uh, Coca-Cola. Uh, I'm assuming the 240. You, you, what time frame are you trading it on? 
Yes, the 240. The 240. Okay, good setup on the daily. Um, let's see here. Uh, look here. Um, yeah, so it'll be 240 and the daily. 240 and the daily. Okay, let's do a side by side then. All right. So yeah, your selection has been, you've been doing really good with your selections. Yeah, only if I had the PL to show it. <laughs> <laughs> All right. So here is the 240 here. Here is the daily. All right. Really nice. Really nice. Nice markdown phase. All right. Um, all we need here, here's your accumulation phase, green candles, uh, just waiting on a buy signal. Let me bring in a, some more data. Uh, let's see. Minus. Okay. We have more data here. All right. So, here is the 240, here is your daily right here, all right? So what I like about the, the daily is that you it held support, right? So it held support down here, all right? Pretty good support. And you've got a white candle here, all right? And that's usually good. You can get some white candles. Usually green candle will follow, all right? And with the market, um, improving, that should help, all right? Um, you don't have a lot of, um, you know, you don't have a lot of room here, right? It's at 50, keep that, keep this in mind. I know we don't talk a lot, a, a lot about this, um, but look to see how, and I know you're doing calls on this. So, you know, that will, that will, you're not trading the underlying stock, you're trading the call. So, you know, that will help. But the range from here to here, all right, um, that's, you know, it's 57 right here and that's 66 right here. Okay, so it's got a it's got a tight, tight range here. So I just keep that in mind. But but it's it's fine here. You gotta just I just wait for a buy signal, right? That should come in. That should come in very soon. All right, but nice markdown phase. Um, let, let me take a look at the, I want to take a look at the monthly to see. Yeah, look to see what the range, how far you can go. Uh, that's the weekly. Um, even with options, that's important too. Um, monthly. Okay, so here is a monthly chart, Zaire. All right. So um, do you have a price, like a price target because it's an option? Do you have a price that you want to, uh, what, what are your calls? Hold on, Dave. Okay. That's a KO, right? Coca -Cola. Yeah, KO, yeah. Coca-Cola. Trying to go to my charts. Yeah, do you have a, like a strike price? Ah, uh, let me see. Uh, all right. So, uh, you know what, like. I haven't had like, because I'm trying to pull up the chart, David. So um, okay. go ahead. Can I find the chart? Because I'm on my phone. 
אוקיי, אוקיי. אוקיי. אני אגיד רק להיות כיפול, אני אגיד. אני אומרת, זה נראה טוב. זה נראה טוב, נכון? יש לי קנדל פה, אתה מקבל גרין קנדל, נכון? זה יכול להמשיך. Right, this is definitely it's in the markup phase. All right, definitely this look very similar to the Dow. So right, very similar to yeah. the Dow. Um, I, I, the, the I'm trying to look for much, David. Um, if it goes back to like sixty, there about. I'm not trying to get all the way up to the top. You know. Okay. So, okay. Because okay. has earning coming up. So if he has okay. good earning, gonna go okay. up on so sixty. Okay. So about. 60, yeah, you shouldn't, that should be fine. Um, uh, 60 should be fine. Uh, uh, so 60 on the 240 would be about here. So here is 60 right here. Yeah, you should, yeah, that should be fine. Oh, and you're, are you in already, Zaya? Yeah, I mean, I'm in both of them. You, and okay. then uh, what I noticed that the, 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 the Nasdaq, they're actually making higher highs on the daily. So um, if it continues that way, it should push it up, right? Oh, Hopefully. yeah. Oh, yeah. Yeah. You you weren't here, but we went over um, we went over the indexes here. So we got um, we don't have a buy signal yet on the Nasdaq. Um, Coca-Cola is that that's part of the Dow. I'm thinking that's part of the Dow. Um, but so here, here is the Dow here. Look at that. And this is on the 240. Okay. So that's look, that looks good. It's markets moving higher. It's definitely moving higher. So if it, if it, um, if it holds on the 240 and then we, 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 we'll track it to on the, um, on the daily, we get buy signals on the daily. We'll move the chart to the daily. This is a new signal we got in today on the S and P, on the S and P right here, Zaire. So that will help. Okay. So um, the selling has stopped for right now. Okay. So that will definitely help your KO. And uh, let's take a look at uh, your Walmart. So yeah, calls right now. Calls absolutely, absolutely. Absolutely. Uh, right here. So W W M T. Yeah, I got in earlier, um, early on the uh the Walmart. I just oh. got in the um Coca-Cola, but I think um once the market continues, hopefully it'll push it up. Oh yeah, it looks good. It absolutely looks good. Um so on Walmart on the daily time frame we got a buy signal. All right. Um on the 240. Yeah. These are good entries. You don't have a buy signal on KO on the 240, but it will come. It will come. Um uh here on Walmart. Um, and you in Walmart already, right? Yeah, I'm deep in. Okay, okay. All right, so nice, nice right here. Buy signal, right? It made it pass all of this consolidation right here. So there's a, the accumulation phase. There was your markdown phase right here. All right, and uh, very nice, very nice. That's the daily. Here is the 240 here. All right. So right here, 240. All right, good, good, very good. Very good. Very good. De we definitely have buying. I mean, that's the message, right? Now, it's not, it's not energy. But you know you can find you can find if you look, if we if we look here. Um, no energy is the it is the number one sector right now right here energy. But if you guys notice here, right? Um, so tech made a move higher today, right? Healthcare made a move higher. Consumer staples, 
all right? Um, industrial, home builders, home construction, financials, utilities, telecom. So they all made a move. Uh, materials, biotech, gold, and real estate, they um, lagged a bit, okay? But uh, it's picking up. Things are picking up, all right? And um, like I said, it looks like we will get that uh, unless something crazy happens, we should get that um, Christmas rally, all right? Every October, right, is a large percentage of the time, right? In October, we get these buy signals, right? We get these buy signals coming in in October, all right? And um, this is really good right here, right? So... The bulls got real lucky. The bulls got real, real lucky, right? So held the 30,000, right? This is on the Dow monthly chart, right? Held that 30,000 right here. And here we are, right? Recovered all those losses from last month, right? And um, got a few more days for the month. And then um, looks like we might crazy right who would who would who would have thought right we could be testing all-time highs with everything that's going on that's why we have to follow this price action okay all right so um zaya good job all right charity good job guys look for um the rest of you look for um you know even if you're getting small look for um look for opportunities um, Bill, you you know, um, you've been trading sniper. I would look at some of these. Uh, you you've been doing some options, so I would look for some of these energy stocks to do some options. Or even Bill, I was going to ask Zaire, how far out yeah, did you go Bill. with your Walmart? Your, Bill, your Walmart options. Bill, yeah. You need like after the call, you need to. I'm gonna ask David to give you my number. You give me a call. I'll do it, man. I'm gonna do it. Yeah. All right. I'll, I'll um I'll yeah. Um Let's fill my number. Didn't you guys was it which which stock that you guys trade before? Traded before Walmart. Today? Was it Walmart? Walmart? Yeah. 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 I think that was back in the spring, right? Yeah. Yeah. I will um Zaya, I'll forward you Bill's information. Okay. Yeah. Um yeah, Bill, you want to be all over those because um um uh, with what's setting up right now, all right, and you trade options, okay. So if anyone else here trades trades options, uh, Charity, I know you don't trade options, but anyone else, you guys want to get together, all right, and um, you know make some money with this. Um, you know, if you're not going to trade the stock, all right, um, and you can trade the stock with you know some of the cheap stocks we're talking about. Right, like in stock boss, right? But if not, um uh do the options. So um yeah, um all right. This this could last. If if the market holds, we could see really we could see a nice rally towards the end of the year. It happens a lot. Right? It happens a lot. Where fourth quarter we, we get a lot of buying, it starts in October. All right, different times in October, but it usually starts in October. There is a, there is a, if you guys want to do further research, uh, there is a good book. Um, and I, I use it. It's called The Trader's Almanac, like the farmer's, like a farmer's almanac. And it shows the historical trends in the markets, the cycles, right? The cycles. All right. And um, fourth quarter is a cycle, right? Fourth quarter is a cycle where capital comes into the market and will push the market higher, all right? Um, and it usually happens in October. So October, November, and they call it the Christmas rally, the Christmas rally. So October, November, December. And that, that's where, you know, there's buying, there's money that's coming into, you know, these companies, right, into the economy for holidays, right, Thanksgiving, Christmas, and so forth. So, um, that's what that's what we're seeing here. That's what we're seeing here. Okay, so um, we can capitalize on that. We don't want to look back, right? Two, three, four months from now and say, "Hey, we missed an opportunity." 
Okay, so you guys get together and um, and get on some of these trades. That Coca Cola, that's a good trade. Walmart, good trades, and it's still early. All right, so if you guys look here, and I'll, this is I'll be done with this. If you guys look here and charity your positions too. If you guys look here, um, these buy signals here very early. This is a very this is under two forty now, and they they you know this is a buy. They haven't even broken out yet, and you guys you're starting to see moves. You know Zaya, you see moves in in that Walmart. That's a nice move already. So they're getting into these stocks already. And you guys saw a lot of the energy stocks we looked at that, you know, the market hasn't even really started to really, you know, get bullish. And these stocks are already moving. So, all right. And look at the VIX. The VIX hasn't even come down really yet. It's still at, um, you know, it's still at almost 30, 29 and change. So imagine, right, the VIX comes down to 20, 18, 16, 15. Right, we could see this market really move higher. Forget what's being said out there. All right, we could see this market move higher, make all time highs. As crazy as it may seem, right, we could definitely see that. All right, so, and we just follow the trend. All right, so good, good job, good job. All right, guys, I will see you guys tomorrow. And um, Zaya, I'll send, um, I'll send Bill's number to you. Okay. Yeah, Bill, give me a call when the yeah. class is done. I'll do it, man. All, All right. right. All right, guys. Take care. And um, look at these stocks. I'm serious. Look at take a look at these stocks. All right. There, there's some opportunities setting up. All right. Take care. Have a good evening. See you guys tomorrow. Bye bye.